Hello, my crafty friends. Well, here's my second video in the series of getting ready for 2024 in my bullet journal. Um, the last video we did the cover page for the year, um, or at least for this book, and however much time I get in this book. Um, and I have several other things down listed that are, you know, I'm thinking of them as a year's yearly pages and things. This one is the key to the book. Um, and I do want to keep that. I'm not going to add a bunch to it because I'm going to try to keep this pretty simple. You can see that it got all wonky when I did this page because I used uh, my Mod Podge type mixture. And um, won't be doing that anymore in this book because I don't want to deal with this anymore. And I've already put something heavy on it trying to straighten it out. And so we're going to we're going to learn that from the beginning. Um, but I am going to leave some space open right here on the key page to um, to add some more things if I decide I want to. But I don't want, I, I don't need this much space. I know that. So I might as well decorate this a little bit. And um, that's what I'm, I'm going to do this morning. It, I've got um, some stuff here. Now these little things I, I found those somewhere else so I just stuck them over here I've got um, I've got more of this writing paper um, that's what we used as the basis behind this was the um, these kind these kinds of papers but I think I want to um, well I say that and now I don't remember where I stuck the rest of those papers and I'm not really in the mood to go hunting for them. No. Okay. I guess we're going to go ahead and use writing papers again for the base. Um, and I I found something. This one's from the bottom. So we're going to use, we'll just start with it because it's already straight here and on the bottom and that's that's what I need to be the bottom part. Something that is straight. Okay. I'm gonna, um, I'm just gonna use a, now this, um, oh, I didn't get much on the, there we go. I'm <laughs> just throwing things around. Okay, that will, you'll still, you can still see that it's bubbly, but it's not, not as bad because it's got some decoration. And, um, let's move these up here. Okay, now I do want, let's find something we can put, you know, over here and. Okay, let's get my ruler. Oh, this isn't the one I was looking for, but it'll work all right. We're going to put this piece right here. I really like that, though, so maybe I, maybe I don't want to do that. So, let's just... Um, just do this. Okay. I don't really want that white stuff behind it. I pulled it the wrong direction. Okay. Right down here. I will have to um, trim the corner again. Let's just do that real quick. Okay. 
Okay. And so. All right, let's just let that be enough of that. I've got some different things. You know, I could use that as a focal point. It's kind of big, so. Maybe you want that one. All right. <laughs> Let's put this one here. Let's we'll start with that. Probably not going to write anything on it. We're just having it there for looks. I think I like that. Let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and put it down. Okay, and then we can put this right there. Sorry, I didn't realize I had y'all out of the... Oh, let's make a mess here. Okay. And I want to add this little piece here. As well. I'm not sure. I can't remember where I laid it. I liked it wherever it was I put it, but... Okay. Let's stick a little mushroom down here, too. I'm not trying to do, you know, a ton to this. I just want it to be um, pretty when I open it to look at the key. Okay, we're going to let that be good as far as the key goes. All I wanted to do was decorate it a little bit. Um, I'll add to it later if I decide I want to. So we've done that one. I do want to add a little bit of uh, decorating to my intentions page because I don't need that much space to write down my intentions for this book. Um, I haven't decided yet if I'm wanting it to be purely a, about this book or if I want to write something about my intentions for the year. I'm not sure. 
but I know I'm not going to need that much space. Um, and I think I can um, write intentions on something else and put it I'm going to pause and think about that a second. Be right back. Okay. I just wrote intentions on this. And um, I'm not sure. Where's my hair? It is. And do that on my page and then I can write my intentions down here okay so let's decide I don't think I want it to say description since since I'm um, I can just trim off the whatever's at the top. Maybe I want to go this way with it. start with that because that looks like it'll be good. I didn't get it very gluey right down there. There we go. And I don't know if I judged it just right or not, but I don't want to put glue above what I want because it'll. Okay, I really didn't intentionally go over the butterfly. Um, wings, but I accidentally did. sure that um, somehow this seems not what I want um see if we have some something bigger we can put in there Let's go ahead and do these. I don't want to be the queen of overthink it today. 
it just makes it take that much longer to get done and this is not really about um, getting it done perfectly it's about making it look pleasant when I open the book um, instead of just like paper but like something that makes me want to open the book okay now I only trimmed it on this side because this is underneath it this um, this part won't show over here but I don't really want um, to cover up the leaves unless you get the edge dirty then it shows <laughs> Okay. Let's go ahead and do. Do those where they're pretty similar. Okay. Oh, I'm just going to go ahead and put glue down here. And then um, I'll know I'm not getting way too much glue and it can dry instead of getting it goopy. Um, trying to put it on the doily okay now then we will let that dry so we've got our key um, decorated we've got our intentions page decorated I do need to come back in and write my intentions and I've got those written down somewhere so I'm going to pause the video and go find them and then I will come back and try to write them in a legible handwriting. <laughs> Be back in a sec. Okay. Um, this is my intentions for this book for this year. And um, that's, I've decided that's all I'm going to put on here is what my intentions are for how I'm going to use this book. Um, and it says my intention for this book is to have one place to keep information scheduled events and ideas so that my stress levels are reduced and productivity is increased so that's what I'm going to write down right here and um, that's my intentions for this book and then um, I'll do another video to work on some more of these things. The index, the future log, the year at a glance, um, birthday and anniversary page, prayer list page, video ideas page, sweater project page. So I've got a bunch more that I need to do um, before we even get to the daily logs for January. So um, I'll be back probably tomorrow with another video. God bless you. Um, love you and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna write this down on camera because <laughs> because my handwriting is horrible and I'm gonna have to go slow so bye-bye love you all God's blessings on you